Voyager 1 and Voyager 2, NASA's audacious explorers have encountered various cosmic challenges, from intense radiation to the profound isolation of being billions of miles away from Earth. As they navigate through uncharted territories, their continued transmission of data offers potential breakthroughs in our understanding of the universe. In this video, we will delve into the relentless cosmic rays bombarding Voyager 1 and Voyager 2, examine the ingenious engineering that keeps them operational, and discuss the profound scientific discoveries they are making in the void between stars. As the Voyager spacecraft voyages beyond the heliosphere, the protective bubble cast by the sun, they encounter a cosmic firing squad, high-energy particles known as galactic cosmic rays, GCRs. These rays, which emerge from massive cosmic explosions like supernovas, travel at nearly the speed of light and constantly threaten the aging electronics of our intrepid explorers, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2. Galactic cosmic rays are not mere protons, but a potent mix of various subatomic particles, including electrons, protons, and the nuclei of heavier elements like iron. These particles, propelled by the explosive force of supernova and the magnetic churn of the galaxy, traverse interstellar space and can penetrate deep into any material they encounter. The interaction between these rays and the spacecraft's materials not only poses a risk to electronic integrity, but also to the data integrity being relayed back to Earth. The immediate effect of GCRs on spacecraft like Voyager is primarily seen in the form of single-event upsets (SEUs). These are incidents where the impact of a single high-energy particle alters the state of a bit in the spacecraft's electronic memory from zero to one or vice versa, potentially corrupting data or causing system malfunctions. Such events have led to temporary losses of communication and data transmission errors, compelling mission engineers to devise strategies for error correction and system resets from billions of miles away. The monitoring systems aboard Voyager continuously assess the flux of cosmic rays, enabling scientists on Earth to adjust operational strategies in real time. These adjustments might involve switching to backup systems, altering the orientation of the spacecraft to minimize exposure to cosmic rays, or changing operational modes during periods of high cosmic ray activity. Moreover, the adaptive use of Voyager's limited shielding capabilities, which are the primary layers of aluminum and other materials. This helps mitigate the impact of these cosmic intruders. Interestingly, the very cosmic rays that pose a hazard also offer scientific opportunities. By measuring the influx of these rays, scientists can glean insights into the processes that govern their acceleration and propagation across the galaxy. These measurements help refine our understanding of the interstellar medium's structure and composition, providing a clearer picture of the cosmic neighborhood through which our solar system moves. Facing the relentless decay of time and technology, Voyager mission teams have continually innovated to overcome unprecedented challenges in deep space communication and power management. Originally equipped with redundant systems to safeguard against failures, the Voyagers were built for longevity, but not indefinitely. Key components such as the flight data system, attitude control, and power subsystems were duplicated to ensure that a backup could take over in the event of a failure. This design philosophy has proven prescient, allowing mission control to switch to alternate systems when primary ones have degraded. For instance, when Voyager 2's primary thruster system showed signs of deterioration, engineers were able to remotely switch to a backup thruster set that had remained unused for decades, demonstrating not only the robustness of the spacecraft's design, but also the enduring acumen of its earthbound stewards. As the electrical power available from the spacecraft's radioisotope thermoelectric generators continues to wane, careful power management has become crucial. Engineers prioritize instruments that are critical for primary mission objectives, occasionally shutting down others to conserve power. This prioritization is a delicate balancing act between gathering valuable scientific data and maintaining the spacecraft's operational health. By crossing the heliopause, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 have provided us with the first direct measurements of the environment in interstellar space. 
These data have revealed a region teeming with thin, hot plasma, contrasting sharply with the relatively denser, cooler plasma within the heliosphere. The observations made by Voyager have been crucial in confirming and refining theoretical models of the heliosphere's boundary. The Voyager's journey provides a roadmap for future interstellar missions. By demonstrating the feasibility of sending spacecraft beyond the solar system, they lay the groundwork for missions that might one day travel to the Oort cloud, the Kuiper belt, or even to nearby star systems. Each bit of data sent back by Voyager informs the design and planning of these ambitious future ventures making them a little less daunting. One of the most understated yet crucial aspects of the Voyager missions is the ability to still communicate with Earth despite the immense distance, which is a testament to the foresight in the design of their communication systems. This has implications for how future spacecraft are designed, particularly in terms of antennas, power usage, and data transmission protocols. In conclusion, the cultural and educational impact of the Voyager missions cannot be overstated. They have not only gathered scientific data, but also captured the public imagination around the world. The golden records carried by the spacecraft, intended to communicate the story of our world to extraterrestrial finders, symbolize the hope and curiosity that drive human exploration. Voyager's journey reminds us of our tiny but unique place in the cosmos and continues to inspire future generations to look up at the stars and dream of what lies beyond. Thank you for joining us on this incredible journey with Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 as they traverse the unknown realms of interstellar space. These spacecraft continue to defy the odds, broadening our horizons and deepening our understanding of the cosmos. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the bell icon to stay updated with more fascinating explorations into the universe. Share your thoughts in the comments below. What excites you the most about these voyages into the unknown? Until next time, keep looking up and questioning the universe around us.